This Christmas, New Year, Sankranti, Ziva Fertility offers you a 30% discount on IVF packages. To know more about this, please feel free to contact us on the numbers that you see on the screen or visit your nearest Ziva Fertility Center. Thank you. Hi, I'm Dr. Swachla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. Let's try to understand the importance of progesterone supplementation after a treatment for fertility. Well, progesterone is usually given at the end of the treatment protocol. As in, if you're getting an ovulation induction done, your egg has released and the doctor is then you know, suggesting that you have intercourse with your partner for so and so days then she will also recommend progesterone to be supplemented as in it could be a vaginal suppository or it could be injectable as well then also with IUI at the end of IUI as in intrauterine insemination after its completion when the partner sperms are put in the uterus progesterone may be supplemented even in IVF progesterone is given why is this done well basically after all the medications are given whether it is letrozole or gonadotrophin injections all these injections and medications uh, help in the egg to ovulate and during this process if the progesterone is not enough uh, or the uh, endometrial lining is not up to the optimal thickness sometimes even when it is normal progesterone is supplemented uh, to give the embryo more chance of implantation in IVF the concept is entirely different your um, cycle is taken under the control of the protocol so for about 10 days gonadotrophins are given for your eggs to grow but during that period for a few days antagonist or ceterolex for example is given so that the eggs don't ovulate untimely then after the growth is achieved the eggs are given an injection which makes them release of course before release of eggs itself the eggs are collected but this injection is very important it's called as a trigger it's usually a human chorionic gonadotrophin this injection makes the eggs ovulate as in the eggs are released from the ovaries but before they are released a needle is passed in and collected so this is the process for uh, IVF now during all this because so many follicles are growing uh, the progesterone may be high or low and if required the progesterone external supplementation will make sure that the endometrium is growing well if you want to go through any of the treatments that I've talked about you want more information you're worried about the medications you want to understand what the side effects could be your chance of success with each protocol please feel free to contact us thank you a lot of effort has gone into making this video please like and subscribe us thank you